Good evening, welcome to Archie Crazy. In today's episode, we're going to do a review. So stay tuned for this episode of Archie Crazy. Alright guys, so what we have here, this is a glow motion drone by Sharper Image. It says toss to launch, side sensors, down sensors, and I'm assuming this has no controller. It says crash free operation, USB-C charging, gesture control, um, gyro stabilization, flight control, drop start launch controls. On the side of the box, there's, there's the gestures, how you control it. The other side of the box says 360 flips, orbiting, crash-free operation. So let's take it out of the box and see what we got. Okay, so the very first thing I noticed is this drone came the same as one of the other drones that they did. This is the demo button in the store where you press it, and then this is supposed to light up. I had literally 500 people commenting asking how to pull, how to pull this little piece out from there because they pulled it too hard and broke the wires out. So what you want to do is, is <laughs> without breaking this off, pull it straight back. That's all I can tell you. Pull it straight back and it should pop out. Don't rip it out. Don't pull it to the left or right. Just pull it straight back and it should come out. If you get it stuck in there, you're going to have to get a pair of needle nose pliers and then you're going to have to try to pull it out. So just a word of caution. Okay, so this is what it came with. Very simple. Your charger, instruction manual, and the drone. That's all it comes with. So let's plug it in and charge it and check out the instructions and then we'll be right back. Alright guys, so let's, let's check this thing out. Let's see what this does. See if we can't bring it out here in the open. I'm going to have to set it down so it calibrates the gyro. Okay, after you turn the drone on, you got to set it down. And it says the LED ring will flicker rapidly. Hold the drone level and steady either in your hands or place it on a flat table or ground until the blue LEDs illuminate. Now the drone is ready to fly. All right. Let's try that out. When the drone is ready to fly, toss it gently away from you. Okay, the lights are blue. Let's see what it does. <laughs> oh, okay, there we go. So in order to keep it flying, you gotta put your hand under it, looks like. Ah. <laughs> this is kind of crazy. So you put your hand in front of the sensor, and that's how you steer it. Ah, okay. Welcome back here. Ah. All right, so. I think I'm gonna let it land so I can get back over to it. How are you driving that? How are you going then? So I was, I'm gonna guess you definitely need a wide open space to fly this because it's just kind of wild.
trying to get it to do tricks, but it's not doing anything. It's just spinning. I guess the uh, lights are blinking under. So it knows there's a tree there. So it's got obstacle avoidance on it. Right now I'm basically letting it do its thing. I try to figure out how to do the tricks. Well, <laughs> and <laughs> this is insane. No. <laughs> I don't know why it keeps going up. Oh my gosh. I don't like it being so high. Alright, now they got under control again. Let's see if I can figure out the tricks. Now oh, this thing, holy cow, you better be in some shape to be able to chase this thing around. Swing hand from top side and the drone will flip in the opposite direction. And see I tried that and didn't do nothing. Yeah, see, it's not, it's not doing the tricks like it's supposed to be doing. Oh, that's it. Alright guys, so my final thoughts on this thing. This is the biggest pain in my butt to ever have to try to figure out how to control. I've ever had to learn on anything. I still have not been able to figure out the 360 rolls on it. But if I do, I'll actually I'll, I'll try to post another video on that. Because I'm going to try it a few more times just to see if I like it or not. Because this thing is just a pain. As you, as you saw in the video, it tried getting away. I mean, it, it didn't go out of, it didn't like totally go out of control, but it was it was not very easy to, to steer. Uh, you can tell the um, the obstacle avoidance on this works very well, but uh, I don't like how it goes up and then it stays up away from you. I don't like that part of it. But anyways, if you like what you're seeing, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to like it. Don't forget to share it. You can check us out on Facebook, and Instagram, and Twitter. Links will be in the description below. If you need to get hold of us for any reason, uh, that'll... We do have an email address, and that will be in the description below. And don't forget, guys, just keep droning.